Hey guys, Jaber Colin here, back out with another video. Today, I bring you another one. This is a survivor story, but before we get on to that, is actually Labor Day in VIC Australia. I don't know what that means, but somewhere in Australia, so happy Labor Day to you guys who are there and watch these videos. Um, without further ado, Let's get on to the sto survivor story. Kirazan, Amoreo, and Tianzia. I think it's Spanish, and my Spanish, like saying Spanish names, is hard for me, so sorry if I mess this up very badly. Not only did Kirazan, Car Amoreo, and Tianzia witness the unthinkable. But she had to remain silent and still the entire time. On July 14, 1966, Richard Speck forcibly broke into a Chicago home shared by nine nursing students and murdered eight of them. Intensia had managed to hide under her bed, eluding Speck's murder spree. From her vantage point, she saw him clearly enough to provide police with a sketch that helped catch the killer. In the ensuing trial, Intenzia was a crucial witness for the state, leading the prosecutor to refer her as 95 pounds of steel and lace. It's like in quotation marks. Speck spent the rest of his life in prison. Intensia, meanwhile, finished her nursing degree, got married, worked as a critical care nurse, and now spends time with her grandchildren. This was a while back, so she might not be alive anymore. But it's to watch like people you knew die in front of you. That's I can't imagine that. I no. Let's see, can I tear this off? Oh, nope, loyal tear. Shoot. Ah, uh, hold on. Ah, no, don't do it. I did it. I got ripped. I almost had it perfect. See, it kind of looks perfect. Maybe? I don't know. Anyway, that's all I have for this time. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace love and funkiness. Bye guys.